what's up everybody <laughs> hey guys welcome back to let's play pokemon vega correct yeah this is an x or y let's stop talking about that and before we start talking again okay the research labs correct that's what we're doing today against the dh members and with their x items that's okay man but you know what i'm gonna get out of here right now let's go to cora and x item oh oh my Oh, wow! What a misclick, but then again, I wasn't punished for it. This isn't Brawl or even Melee, if you're into that. Okay then, so this whole area has a little trick to it. And if you don't know Japanese, you're going to be stuck here for years on end. Although, oh, okay, okay. What you have to do is talk to these little boxes in the wall, telephones, whatever you want to call them. They don't look really telephony. They're just in the wall. And you talk to them, and they make the barricades out of the way, right? Yeah. Alright. So we'll get to that. Alright, after this battle, I didn't see what he's gonna send out, because I usually just click. Oh, dear. Hmm. Let's go Bubja. Yeah, I need to start training up Bubja and Machu for the gym, honestly. Oh, great. Oh, this gym. Just gonna keep hyping it up because it's pretty tough. And Pineco, deary me. One hit? Yeah, oh, well, it was a critical hit. Don't mind that. Okay, as I was saying, you gotta talk to these things right here. It's like, I don't know what's going on. Maybe the gap is opening it up and removing some wires here and there and slicing them. And it turns off the security systems. I have no idea, but... What happens though is like this guy will get out of the way. There's another guy later on that you have to get out of the way too, just by talking to those things. We'll get to that later. Well, a bent spoon. Oh boy, that's a twisted spoon, by the way. No one really benefits from it, so who cares? That's where we gotta go. Remember that guy was like running away or got taken hostage? Who knows? That's cool, buddy. All right, back to our program here. We gotta keep battling. Oh, have we seen this guy yet? I don't think we have. It's normal fire. Cat dude evolves to dark fire guy. It looks no, oh, well, it kind of froze there. Wow, I just noticed the frames per second went to like 13,000, <laughs> and now it's back to 15 frames per second. Okay, well, all I did was karate chop. Yeah, okay, huh? I never noticed that. Very interesting. Well, let's get out of here and go to Pupja. Sure, because I got uproar. That can come in handy. I'm really glad that he did up uproar up uproars up uproars power don't you dare get poisoned cool because just the uproar was so weak it was like no point of it being like making you stuck into the move you know oh double team who cares double team all right is there anything no alrighty then well we did everything here now yeah i guess we can keep going down here yeah there are a couple of those little uh, box things so we'll have to take care of those in a bit. X defend. No, I was worried about that. Oh, wow. My chew. It's so powerful. Holy. Let's stay in. Jeez. No need to a uh, coward out here, man. Cow being the goat guy. Tull. Oh, boy. All right. Now, where are we going? Who knows? Okay. Hiya, sir. <laughs> Inspect the area around you, then take a battle with you. Whoa! Gutel's evolution. We'll call this Metolt. Yeah, Metolt. That's great. It's still Steel, I believe, but its final evolution is Steel Dark. I've been meaning to use it since forever, but that typing just makes you weak to fighting, and there are a lot of fighting types in this game, so I'd rather not. He's just asking for it, you know? Oh boy. Let's see, just like this Hound Hour. Poor Hound Hour. Ouch. 22. And oh, let's just see it. Okay. Ooh. What do we call this guy? I don't even remember. Oh. Roll out. That's neat. Well, let's go for Thunder Shock on the Gotta save up on your karate chop action. Cool. 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 But dinner is cancelled. Okay. Bubja. Buddy. Bub. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. Alright, now that we're pretty much almost done, honestly. Um, there's uh, something about X and Y that I haven't talked about. Okay, as last episode, I swear that I'm going to talk about until the next news comes out. That's 
talk to these toys, by the way. Uh, about the customizable characters. Everyone's saying customizable characters. I really hope there is. I've been waiting for that since Diamond and Pearl, honestly. It makes sense since it was Wi-Fi based. Like, first game Wi-Fi based. They did it in PBR, though, which was cool and all, but it was really limited. And, mm, well, not a lot of people played PBR, so you can't really show off your dude's clothes and all that. So it'd be cool in a battle. And that's another thing I want about X and Y. For your trainer to be in the battle, like while the scene's going around, like in Coliseum and XD, it actually shows your trainer, like on the side. So, uh, like so far in the trailers, I haven't seen the trainer, like in the, like behind the Pokemon. Yeah. But I just hope they're there, and then you can see, like, hey, that's my trainer. Oh man, looking pretty snazzy, yo. And you can say that like every battle. Go up to Bobja. So that's all I want. Just the whole reasoning behind everyone saying it's going to be customizable trainers. So you can put clothes on them or whatever. Because there's one scene where a glitch happens in the trailer. And the main character, like the guy, actually loses his glasses. Everyone's assuming it's a glitch because his glasses just fall off. Like he swings on the rope. Remember that part in the trailer? He swings, and then his glasses stay right there. So, well, they look like his glasses, because while he's swinging, he doesn't have the glasses on his hat. So, they're just extra part, and that's why they stay there. Yeah, a very interesting thing to put in your trailer, but okay, I guess they missed it somehow. Alright, well, this is the guy we gotta get out of the way, but remember, there's that one guy five years away in length. Oh, it's this way. Yeah. Okay. So, oh, he's gone. So, I don't know what's going on. Are we giving out, like, false announcements? Like, hey, we want the guy standing in front of the door to get out of the way and we need help over here. So that's what's happening? I don't know. Oh, well. Oh, oh, yeah. so, yes, customizable characters. Yes, self-destruct. Jeez, I thought I wasn't going to have to heal, but no. Oh. Uh. Great. Well, since I'm going to heal anyway, let's hit him. Oh, jeez. Didn't get poison pointed. Am I going to get poison pointed now? No. Oh, man. Tempting the fate here. Jeez. Okay. Hiya. And with that, we're done with this whole thing. Okay. Well, um, do we even need to heal? Oh, it looks like we don't have to. Well... <laughs> Let's just move on then. See, now the guy's out of the way. Whoa, whoa, what are you guys doing here? Oh, okay, let's let's do battle. Now for this battle, you want to keep as many of your guys alive because there's going to be a way tougher battle right after this. Just keep that in mind. All right, so let's just go out to Korra. I'm hoping one water gun can take it out. Come on, go Korra, go. Oh, look at that. Don't you know... All right, that's okay. That's all right. Um, hmm. As long as it doesn't keep going for body slam, I guess I'm fine. I'll just go for a seal. What is that? Super effective accuracy. Shining ball. What? Ow. Well, wow. This was completely unnecessary damage, and I really wish I didn't take that much damage. Okay. Oh, oh, what was that? Hopefully it's Nidorino. It's a Nidorino. Oh man. Let's go for dig. Yeah. Yeah. Watch as I get poison pointed. Oh man. What poison tail? Holy. Doesn't even have a tail. It probably has a little tiny tail. But can't signify enough for a tail, you know? Okay. And lastly. Oh boy. What you're supposed to look at, by the way, to see what they're going to send out, is that bottom left characters right there. See it? Yeah, so try to memorize, like, the first character most of the time. I don't know, like, for Nidoran, it's the equal sign, like I mentioned. And it comes in handy, knowing what it looks like. Alright, uh, we could go to Korra. Hmm, what is it? Oh, let's go to Korra, whatever. Okay, hopefully we'll get lucky. Oh, it's Bernio. Okay. I doubt Water Gun's gonna take it out. Oh, but the guy... Oh, I got a crit. <laughs> He wasted a turn to go for the X item anyway, which I keep forgetting. It just, uh, oh well. Look over there. Huh? What's going on here? Oh man, a battle. Well, sure. Whoa, had it, guy. 
Thanks, buddy. You take care of that dude while I take care of the much more threatening guy who has the same sprite as that guy anyway, but he's actually a character that has a significance. <gasps> it's N! Actually, I don't know, but he has got a cape, and it looks like it's... It could be a carpet, honestly. That, that'd be a pretty cool carpet, actually. Okay, starts with a hound hour. Um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> don't worry, though. This is just the beginning of the battle. Next up is, who knows, let's go to Korra, we could go Intimidate it, sure, that sounds better actually. Okay. Just when in doubt, you Intimidate. Oh, a Star You, well, this is the worst switching in the world. We do have one turn to switch out though, so how about I just, I mean, it's gonna have one turn to set up an X item. Uh, okay, okay, <laughs> what about an X special? Oh great, this is bad. Well, look at that. Body Slam did about half. That's good. Well then, hmm, who's faster than a star you? Maybe Machu? I'm 24, it's 23, but uh, Thundershock's not gonna kill. Hmm, 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 hmm. Or Karate Chop. Hmm. Let's see, 60. Oh, wow. Look at its attack difference, by the way. I don't think I've noticed that. Okay, well, I'll go to Mint Bird. Just a sacrifice. Sorry, buddy. Ugh, no, not my mint bird. And now we go to Machu, and we can outspeed it and go for a karate chop. No, we can't. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. <gasps> Whoa, Machu, how did you live that? Amazing, amazing. Okay, with that out of the way, all we have to fear is... What is it? Oh, no, it's not a haunt or something. It's Skarmory. Oh, this is miles upon miles worse. Because this guy is pretty tough. And I'm not looking forward to taking him out at all. Now, I want to yawn it, but first what I'm going to do is go to Banjo and intimidate it. I should have done this first. Oh, well. X special. <laughs> um, okay. Okay, then. I could go for Charm, but who knows? You know, I'm sure I can live, especially after that intimidate. Okay. Maybe go for Lick afterwards? Yeah, let's just go for Charm. Magnet Ball. No, that's special. Right? No. Right? Man, who uses Magnet Bomb? Well, we'll find out right now if I can sponge this rather well. Yeah, it seems to be physical then. Okay. Because it's also, oh, it's Mirror Shot. That's what I'm thinking of. All those moves, like, no one learns it. And Mirror Shot is so bad. It's, it's like such bad accuracy. I don't know why they created it. But it's really annoying when you're using, like, Magneton. And it can't really do much. Okay, anyway. Do I save Banjo? Yeah, 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 sure. Okay. I can just go to uh, Rambi and go ahead and intimidate it once again. But what I want to do is go for Yawn. And then... I don't know. I don't really have much for it. I guess I could confuse Ray with Korra while it's asleep. Yeah, but Bubja needs to get out of there immediately because he can't do much to it. Rambi can't do much either. All I have is Machu. Wow, okay. Didn't think this would give me so much trouble. I really wish I had Thunder Punch Machu. It gets it at 26, by the way. So that's going to be a while. Unfortunately. Unfortunately, that does nothing. Cool. Okay, I could freely go out to Rambi. And as it snoozes this turn and goes for Drill Run. Yeah, that exists in this game. Kind of annoying. We go to Rokora and. Uh, good. Now, this is the part where, whoa, it's faster, holy, okay, it's confused now. Oh, and how I wish Whirlpool would stay while you switch out or anything like that. It, like, I know wrap makes sense in that scenario, like, you wrap it and then you switch out and then wrap wears off, but with Whirlpool, I can imagine a Whirlpool staying there while you switch out, I don't know. Oh, well, same with Fire Spin. And, oh, look at how lucky we got, oh man. Good. Oh dear, I was really worried about that dude. Okay, and finally is the Haunter. Oh boy, what do we do? Well, I've got Bubja for it, and its main form of attacking is through Hypnosis and uh, Dream Eater. So maybe we can get lucky here, or we could just die to Shadow Ball. Okay. Yeah, this is kind of frightening. Okay. What do we do? Oh dear. Rambi, if I'm stuck with Rambi and Machu, I won't be able to win, so it's up to Bubja. Oh my. Okay, all I need is Yawn to activate. Or should I just Feign Attack? I'm sure Feign Attack will take it out. Okay. 
This is the annoying part. It can't actually go for a Dream Eater though, so all it can do is Shadow Ball. I wish I had a normal type alive. Great. This is bad. Okay. You know, it's really tempting using the revive, but I'm telling you, there are no revives in this game. Don't use them. Don't do the mistake I did. Okay, so it's gonna go for Shadow Ball. Do we try to wake up? Yeah, I think it'd be better to just hope to wake up instead of it going for Shadow Ball and hitting something else. Oh man, like that! Oh! Yes! Bubja clutching it and parking it in rear gear. We did it! 25! Yes! Almost Thunder Punch, which would have really helped. Unfortunately, we didn't even get to that level. I really thought we would after all these battles. Okay, announce for another battle. No, this guy's a friendly dude. Okay, thanks friendly dude, and it fades out once again. Well, unfortunately there's nothing around here, like you can get over here, but no, there's nothing. I don't know. It seems like a perfect place to put something. Also right here there's like a rock? Huh? Interesting. Well, as fun as today's events were, we're gonna have to stop here for today. Next time... Oh man, what do we do next time? Oh, there's the gym. <laughs> oh boy. Okay, for the gym... Wow, look at everyone almost dead. Machu really needs a Thunder Punch. It's gonna get it next level. And... And I need Bubja. Oh boy. I might just grind up, but then again there's a bunch of trainers in the gym. And I want to be 28 to 30 for the gym leaders. Everyone else I don't really mind, but it would be nice for them to be a bit higher level. Actually, they're fine. Just Bub Yamache. Okay, we'll do that next time. Also, we need to restock on Super Potions. So let's go ahead and do that. Wow, look at that zero. Yeah, let's bring 10, because honestly, there's never any use for money. <laughs> there's no revives. There's no full restores. And that's... It's all the money you're going to waste. Okay, next time, gym time. See you guys later.